Hey everyone, I'm Bella from New Services of the Pulsar Public Library. Today I wanted to share with you one of the best books that I have read in 2020 so far. And it's actually a book that I read while we were closed. Uh, I was running out of reading material and I asked one of my coworkers for suggestions and she recommended The Running Dream by Wendelin Van Dronen. I loved it so much that I wanted to recommend it to you all. It's actually um, in our young adult section. It's a young adult fiction. Uh, I would say the genre is kind of like realistic fiction, but I highly recommend it for adults and teens alike. It was so good. Uh, the author's writing style was very easy to read. She actually wrote in the voice of the main character, which I don't know about some of you all, but I like to read from the perspective of the main character. I always enjoy the books that are uh, written that way. My attention was captured in the first chapter and I literally could not put it down. I read it in about less than two days. It was a very inspirational story. This 16 year old girl, she goes through uh, a bus accident and loses one of her legs. The story actually picks up when she's in the hospital after the amputation. She has to recover and it follows her struggles of her going back to school and accepting the fact that she lost a leg. It's really neat to see the other characters that are developed. The characters are very real. I felt like I could really relate to them. For example, uh, the main character, Jessica, she struggles with math, so she's dealing with that while she's also dealing with getting used to a prosthetic leg. I've always struggled with math, so that was something I could really relate to. That's kind of a running theme alongside her learning to walk with the prosthetic leg, but she has to deal with those new changes in her life, and she actually ma she makes friends with people that she never a dream to making friends with. One of them is actually a girl with cerebral palsy and uh, that girl actually helps our main character Jessica uh, with her math. So I thought that was really neat. One thing I forgot to mention that Jessica loves to run, hence the title The Running Dream. That's what she lived for uh, before the accident was running. So she almost doesn't even want to learn to walk again because uh, what is walking to her? She lived to run. She doesn't think that she can ever run again. She So she feels like she has no hope to live for. But her friends push her on and her teammates actually do fundraisers and bake sales and such to raise money to buy her a running leg uh, to get her running again. I'll leave it at that so that you guys can read the story and find out what happens for yourselves. So you can either check it out at the library or on our online resources. I highly recommend it. It was an awesome read and I know you'll love it too. Bye.